everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a video that's been requested so many times about the original Tommy Girl fragrance. This has been out for a really long time, um, it's a classic, but I'm going to let you know what I think of it. Most of you probably know what it smells like. And then we also have the brand new 2021 summer edition of Tommy Girl. I'm going to be comparing the two, letting you know what this new one smells like. I also have a sample of Tommy Girl Now and the other more recent recent new fragrance from the Tommy Girl range so I'll let you know what these three smell like. If you're new here then hi welcome we are all about perfumes so check out my hundreds of other videos and if you're a regular but you haven't subscribed yet then do hit that subscribe button show your support and you can support me on Patreon now as well and as always guys I will leave the links below in the description box to where you can buy all these perfumes I talk about in the UK Europe and North America. So let's start with original Tommy Girl this came out in 1996 I remember you know as a child seeing adverts for this it was a really big fragrance sort of top 10 bestseller for a long long time and it's still very much sold now it's incredibly affordable you can find this at really low prices online I'll find it at a good price and put it in the links in the description it is an eau de toilette it's a very fresh floral and I think it's perfect like the na name says for a girl you know first perfume a teenager but you can absolutely wear this at any age you could wear this at 90 at 60 at 30 it's just a pretty and nice affordable fragrance and I think that's why it stood the test of time and is still very much sold today so what does it smell like it definitely is a smell that you recognize like you everyone will have known someone that wore this fragrance it's a fresh lemony floral so at first you get that fresh lemon and the lemon does really stay around but you've got honeysuckle you've got rose you've got a blossomy note in there I think it's apple tree blossom it's really pretty magnolia almost a slight powderiness underneath I think that's from a lily note and a bit of violets they've basically taken like loads of really pretty floral notes and put them all in here and then added a really fresh lemon and some grapefruit as well so it just comes across as everyday pretty floral it's not crazy fresh because of all those flowers it's like a bouquet of flowers that has a lot of different things in but it is floral it's not green floral it's not like going outside into a dewy floral garden it's more like a daytime big big bouquet of flowers I think what's quite good about it is even though it's an eau de toilette it does have quite good lasting power and projection you can smell it on yourself it sticks around and that's probably a big reason why um, it's continued to sell so it's just a classic difficult to dislike pretty everyday floral so next we have the brand new 2021 Tommy Girl Summer so this is definitely similar to the original. It really reminds me of the original. I'd say it's perhaps just a simpler version of the original. It has a musky magnolia as the main note, which gives that same musky floral vibe as the original. And then rather than a lemon, it has a mandarin orange. So it essentially gives a similar vibe but just slightly different perhaps slightly more fruity slightly simpler and um, but it also has a sort of violety undertone like a makeup undertone it comes in a really cute bottle I love this packaging this design in the Tommy Hilfiger colors it's a pretty gift I think if you like the original Tommy girl then you'll definitely like this version and um, you could definitely layer the two together it's not massively different I thought perhaps they would make this like totally different but they've stuck with I guess that winning formula of the original smell just added it a bit more tangerine perhaps just up it's a slightly more updated version of the original and then the other new one Tommy Girl Now this came out a couple of years ago and I just did a video recently on the other unisex fragrance in this range that just came out 
but this one is very much I think feminine it's definitely more fresh than the other two I think it has mint in uh, bergamot orange and then it has that signature magnolia and a slight muskiness underneath just like Tommy girl but I think this is much more fresher from the packaging and the design it feels like perhaps this is a little bit more practical sporty fragrance perhaps something you'd spray after you've been out I don't know playing tennis or whatever a, a Tommy Hill figure girl does you know something just to refresh you after a shower or something like that it's just a little bit more lighter and um, perhaps for hot weather this would be better rather than having so much of those floral notes like the other two do um, but it's broadly similar to the others it's a fresh floral a citrusy floral that seems to be the vibe that the Tommy Hill figure female fragrances go for so guys let me know what you think what which is, which is your favorite from the range which one do you like let me know in the comments down below hope this has been useful helpful and um, but that's it so thanks so much for watching as always and i will see you in the next video bye